What do you think you are uh, doing? Look, Kennedy, we kissed. And I don't want to exaggerate the importance of it, but we're gonna be together forever. Come on, she's drunk. She also kissed a talking peanut. Right here on me left nut. So, uh, who's it gonna be? Cleo, I care about you. And every moment we spend together makes me want to know you more. My abs are so firm, you can grate cheese on them! It's so hard to choose. I need some time to be alone. Nacho? Oh, man, that does suck. If that were me, I would probably kill myself. Hello? Hey, Joan, cool stun gun. Wait, I can explode. Ow! I forward it. Ooh! Egg whites only, please. Team Crisis Hotline, we're here because we care. <laughs> Not the piñata. It's me, your memorable school chum, Cloney McStudent. Piñata. Uh-huh. Well, choosing between a jerk who's good for your image and a nice, sensitive guy is not really much of a problem. What should I do? Go for the jerk. Ooh, and sleep with him right away. It's never too early for your first time. Oh, and also, don't floss your teeth. Hmm. You do have to make sacrifices to be the best. <sighs> Damn it. You know what? Go with the nicer guy. And flossing keeps gums healthy and removes plaque from hard to brush areas. Woo! Did you just screw yourself? Woo! You know, even if these pants do fall off, I'm still wearing boxers. Ah, good thing there was no one around to see that. Oh, yes. No one, indeed. After consulting a random person on the telephone, I've come to a decision. I choose you. Oh, great. Abe? Boy, salty seconds. <laughs> Want a beer? Sure. Maybe pretending to be drunk will ease the pain. So, uh, are you uh, drunk enough yet to sleep with me? <laughs> Answer the question. <laughs> yes. Well, well. It isn't my old friend. Underage drinking. So we meet again. How are you, underage drinking? Besides illegal. Underage drinking? Shame on all of you. Shame! Back to you, Kojak. This kid's not sober, is he? And none of you are 21, are you? And these pot stickers aren't made with real crab, are they? I stand corrected. You, you're holding it for Get in! Get in! Well, that's two, which is all we can fit in the squad car. The rest of you are free to go. Come on, Abe. Leave your friends behind and come back to my soundproof basement. But your taste still lingers on my lips Like I just placed them upon you And I starve I starve for you Let them go. Son, if we don't enforce the drinking age, the excitement of sneaking around to get wasted might disappear forever. You want that on your shoulders, pal? It's non-alcoholic beer. <gasps> I knew it! I guess I was just looking for what all of us are. Acceptance. <coughs> Loser! I am so funny. <laughs> Where's my report? Shadowy ah! figure. It's actually a funny story. I was working on it, and I tried to email it to myself, but then my roommate... That is a funny story. Mr. Butletron, lower the shades and lay down a tarp. Okay, I spent the entire weekend among the teenagers. I was humiliated, degraded, judged. I felt so alone. Where'd he go? I guess you prove to him you understand what it feels like to be a teenager. And 
the piñata. Well, from now on, I'll be more sensitive to the awkwardness and emotional insecurity of today's youth. Out of my way, fatty. You do bad skin. <laughs> well, I'm not going to let this get me down. I'm up. Look, right now you're a loser. A, a big one. But soon, someone else will make an even bigger ass of themselves, and then everyone else will forget about what a big, 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 big loser you are. <laughs> Thanks, Van Gogh. I hate this school. Next week, on a very special Clone High. Abe's competition with JFK heats up at the school election. Gandhi provides some sort of comic relief. And special guest star Marilyn Manson makes a shocking confession. My name is Marilyn Manson, and I'll see you next time at Clone High.